I just came through here and I'm soaked. Filled my boots and the gators didn't do anything. I think it's safe to say that the lake that I was planning to cross is not safe to cross. It's been pretty warm the last couple of days, so I'm gonna turn back and I'm gonna cut off into the woods, find a different place to camp tonight. But first, what a wonderful feeling that is. This place definitely has charm, that's for sure. Sweet, home. Beautiful spot. So it's currently in the positives, but it's supposed to go down to negative eight or nine tonight. I don't plan to make any sort of shelter, so this is it. All I have left to do is explore the area, cook some food, get some firewood, hang out, enjoy my night out here in the bush. I found a piece of oak over there. This branch was laying on its side. Usually I don't like to collect any type of wood that's on its side because it allows for a lot of water to penetrate into it, but it looked decent enough. Anyways, I processed it all up and it uh, turns out it's quite uh, rot. All this around the outside, it absorbed water like a sponge. The inside is still quite dry. It still might burn, but not as well as I was hoping it would. Anyways, I'm gonna get the fire started and let's go from there. So this is a turkey locator and it imitates the sound of a crow. And for whatever reason, turkeys actually respond to the sound of crow with a gobble. Hear that?
This is the new wood. This is the wood from before. Bushcraft. Oh man, I'm hungry. So tonight for dinner, we have sloppy joes that I made at home on mini buns. So it's basically ground beef, steak seasoning, onions, garlic, mushroom, red wine vinegar, Worcestershire sauce, tomato sauce, and tomato paste. So I figured I'd make these at home because it was a little bit sloppy to make out here in the bush. Oh, shoot. Ah, a little crispy, a little crispy. Don't look that great. <laughs> these are gonna be so sloppy. Maybe the mini buns is not a great idea. They look great. Excellent. Mmm. Sloppy Joe sliders. Awesome. I just got some softwood so we can get the fire going nice and easily in the morning. I'll burn all this hardwood tonight. It burns nice and slow and stable. I'll get use this in the morning to get the fire going. Maybe save a few pieces of hardwood for the morning.
I slept really well last night. That was a great sleep. Time for coffee and breakfast. I am so excited for this one. I have toast, eggs, condensed milk, vanilla extract, and cinnamon, and maple syrup. I'm doing French toast. And I can use some skim milk for my coffee. Yeah. Yum. I love waking up early. Feels like you have the whole day ahead of you. Does anybody else wake up hungry? I find every morning I wake up really hungry. And it's not negative nine, that's for sure. It's pretty warm out. I'd say it's almost in the positives. Oh yeah, that's good. Great little one-nighter out here in the middle of the woods. What a nice little spot to spend a nice evening and get some good old, good old rest, you know? Anyways, it's very clear that spring is in the air. I'm getting pretty excited for summer tripping, canoeing, and all that. I'll miss the winter, but you know what? That sun on my skin and the warm air in my hair, it's making this boy get pretty dang excited to uh, get on with it, you know? It's officially spring, you can feel it. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that one as much as I did. Thanks for watching, have a great day.